dear students continuing with our lecture series on multiple choice question problems uh, this is our uh, second such lecture where we will see some unique uh, multiple choice question problems based on organic reaction mechanism so as i have given you uh, in the previous lecture uh, there are again five problems in this lecture also and uh, in the same way uh, we will first uh, see only the questions and then answers and afterwards uh, we will see how uh, these uh, products they have been formed uh, through organic reaction mechanism so first problem in this case is uh, these types of uh, cyclopropane derivatives uh, containing aromatic uh, ring and uh, alpha alpha dichloro uh, substitutions when they are reacted under acidic conditions uh, nitric acid and sulfuric acid what will be the product out of these uh, four types of products which have been given so uh, what we need to know uh, whether uh, the nitration will take place uh, on the aromatic ring or uh, some other uh, reaction will take place on the uh, cyclopropane ring so depending upon uh, the type of reagent which we are using uh, nitric acid and sulfuric acid we will get the product then second problem is uh, uh, these types of substrates uh, pyro, uh, these are uh, pyrolo quinoline quinones so this is uh, pyrrole ring and uh, this is uh, quinoline ring and uh, these are the ortho quinone derivative and uh, there are three ester groups present so pyrrolo quinoline quinone uh, trimethyl ester derivatives when uh, they are reacted with uh, trimethoxy uh, formate uh, in presence of paratoline sulfonic acid as the catalyst under acidic condition then uh, what uh, possible reaction can take place uh, to give us a major product which uh, may be out of these four choices so we need to know whether there will be a cycliz uh, cyclization at this place or the methoxy group as a nucleophile uh, will uh, attach to uh, or attack to these uh, carbonyl compounds uh, or of quinone to give us different kinds of products. Then third problem is uh, these types of alkenes in presence of these types of uh, carbonyl compounds uh, when they are reacted with uh, tertiary butyl lithium uh, in THF then followed by a reaction with par acid like uh, metachloroparbenzoic acid at 0 degree centigrade what will be the product out of these uh, four possibilities Then uh, fourth problem is uh, quinoxaline anoxides, these types of sub substrates. So this molecule is quinoxaline and uh, oxide of this is called as anoxide because uh, oxygen is attached to the nitrogen. When this is reacted with uh, trimethyl cyanide, uh, cyanide in presence of dichloromethane as solvent, uh, what will be the product out of these three, uh, these four products? And uh, we are using uh, an excess of trimethyl slide side as the pH. Then uh, these types of uh, diterpene esters, uh, they usually undergo skeletal rearrangement and if uh, these diterpene esters uh, they are reacted with bromine uh, in presence of water THF uh, as a polar solvent and sodium bicarbonate for uh, recovery of the products uh, then what will be the major product 
and in this case major product is formed in 41% uh, and out of these four which will be the major so uh, these are the answer to the five problems which we have discussed first question is having answer b second is also b third is d fourth is c and fifth is a and in the subsequent slides we will see that how these products they are formed so in question one as i told you answer is b in case of cyclopropane ring having an aryl functional group present in addition to dichloropropane so as uh, we have seen that uh, sulfuric acid in presence of nitric acid generates uh, this electrophilic uh, intermediate nitronium ion and then this uh, nitronium ion uh, can undergo uh, electrophilic uh, reaction with the substrate and because of the presence of uh, lone pair of electrons on the halogen uh, this can be shared with uh, this carbon halogen bond to acquire a positive charge at this chlorine and this carbon carbon bond will break and delocalization of pi electron will lead to the formation of this type of intermediate with the opening of this cyclopropane ring and Uh, nitronium ion instead of uh, attacking the aromatic ring because now aromatization has been converted into this intermediate this uh, attacks uh, this uh, carbon carbon double bond and uh, electrophilic uh, addition of this nitronium ion take place with this reagent to give us this type of intermediate and uh, then uh, because this uh, oxygen is an electronegative oxygen having negative charge this attacks as a nucleophile to this uh, carbon halogen bond to neutralize the positive charge on this halogen and a five membered cyclic uh, heterocyclic uh, intermediate of this type is formed then this uh, five member heterocyclic intermediate uh, will undergo 1 3 hydrogen shift uh, to give us uh, uh, this type of uh, intermediate then uh, this intermediate uh, this 1 3 uh, hydrogen shift will take place from this carbon to this oxygen so we will get this type of enolic uh, intermediate then uh, in presence of hso4 negative which has been formed in the first step this proton is abstracted to neutralize the uh, charge on this nitrogen and we will get these types of uh, five member heterocyclic ring compounds containing nitrogen and oxygen then uh, this will uh, lose uh, one halogen atom from here to give us uh, these types of intermediates uh, which will lose uh, oh from here and cl uh, which uh, which is formed at this place will uh, abstract this uh, oh group to uh, remove hocl hypohalous chloride will be removed to give us this product which is our b choice so uh, this is how uh, the nitration uh, this is a uh, abnormal type of reaction where nitration on the benzene ring is not taking place instead the breaking of this cyclopropane ring take place and we can say that uh, alicyclic ring is converted into a heterocyclic ring with ring expansion the substrate through uh, nitration reaction then uh, second reaction was uh, uh, in case of uh, pyrrolo quinoline uh, quinone trimethyl esters uh, when they are reacted uh, with uh, trimethoxy orthoformate uh, this in presence of uh, uh, 
paratolin sulfonic acid will uh, release methanol molecules and these methanol molecules uh, they will attack the carbonyl of the quinone in the first step to give us these types of intermediate and then uh, this will uh, lose uh, uh, H positive ion from here and this will get attached to this oxygen active to neutralize the negative charge on oxygen and positive charge on this oxygen and we will get this type of intermediate. Then uh, in presence of PTSA, paratolin sulfonic acid, so H ions, uh, they will uh, react with this hydroxyl group and we will have this positively charged water molecule which can be easily removed with the delocalization of this charge. So water molecule is removed and we will get this type of intermediate. Then uh, second methanol molecule which is generated from trimethoxy orthoformate and uh, this will attack this carbon carbon double bond to neutralize the positive charge on nitrogen and we will get these types of products where uh, the methylation uh, methoxy group will uh, get attached to the uh, carbonyl groups uh, which were present okay. so this is how this b product is formed in this case Then third question is, uh, answer is T, as we know uh, when uh, tertiary lithium uh, reacts with these alkenes, uh, they will form a carbonyl and that carbonyl uh, will uh, get attached to uh, the enol uh, formed by this molecule and we will get these types of uh, intermediate and these intermediates uh, they can be isolated also or in situ they can react with metachlorobenzoic acid uh, we know uh, that because of the steric entrance uh, epoxidation will take place as this carbon carbon double bond and we will get these types of epoxides and as uh, methanol group uh, uh, methanol is present as a solvent so uh, methyl, uh, methanol can attack either from this side or from this side so we can have either this product or this product but if you uh, see our uh, choices uh, only uh, one of these two have been given as choices and that is our D so D will be formed as the product by opening of this epoxide ring by the methanol which is present as a solvent so otherwise if uh, we are not using methanol or any uh, uh, we are not using any polar protic solvent then uh, epoxides they will be but here because of the presence of this polar protic solvent this uh, epoxide ring breaks to give us these types of alcohols as the Uh, then these types of anoxides, uh, they react with trimethylsalyl cyanide in the first step and uh, trimethylsalyl group will get as a positive entity will get attached to this oxygen and the cyanide ion will be formed. Then the cyanide ion will act as a nucleophile uh, uh, because of uh, the presence of this uh, positive charge on this nitrogen this uh, carbon will become uh, electrophilic and because of this uh, this nucleophile will act this carbon by delocalization of the charge we will get this type of intermediate and then uh, one three shift of this hydrogen will take place from this carbon to this oxygen and we will have this type of positively charged uh, species then uh, this uh, carbon ion will uh, neutralize uh, uh, this molecule by removal of trimethylsalyl uh, hydroxide and we will get uh, the choice C as the product. The uh, quinoxaline 2 carbonitrile will be formed as the product. So this is how the answer is C in case of question number 4.
Then last is uh, in case of uh, diterpene esters, the choice is uh, answer is choice A. So what happens is in the first step, uh, this uh, terminal carbon-carbon uh, double bond interacts with the bromine molecule, and we will get uh, this type of uh, bromonium ion uh, by addition of the bromine to this carbon-carbon double. And then uh, shifting of this carbon-carbon uh, uh, double bond will attack over this place to open this ring and we will get this type of carbocation. And this uh, carbocation then uh, will undergo uh, ring expansion action by breaking of this carbon-carbon bond and we will get uh, this type of uh, carbocation. So, uh, this carbocation is more stable in comparison to this, that is why this ring expansion is taking, uh, taking place. Then this carbocation will uh, react with uh, water uh, present in the reaction mixture. Uh, water will be added and we will get uh, alcohols on reaction with sodium bicarbonate like this. So, removal of uh, water from here then uh, uh, sodium bicarbonate uh, this will uh, react to give us NABR and carbon dioxide and this uh, NABR uh, this Na positive from here and Br negative from here will be eliminated then uh, carbon dioxide from here and OH from here uh, will take up uh, one proton and we will get uh, these types of which is the product which is our choice A. This is the major product and if you see all the four choices uh, other three products they can be formed from this product only but major product is this one in actual all the four uh, choices which have been given they are formed as the product but major product is this one because only this uh, product will uh, give us the other three thank you very much